Welcome Gemini's. I'm back y'all with another video. So this is going to be a read for January. So it is going to be a general read. Whatever pops out, pops out. Take what resonates, leave the rest. Also guys, this reading can be vice versa. So you can reverse the roles if need be and only take what applies, okay? Any messages for Gemini, please? Give me a message for Gemini. Give me a message for Gemini, please. So, I see you, I see, um, we got the nine of swords at the bottom of the deck, so there could be a little bit of worry, we got the emperor here as well, I feel like you, you, um, feel like maybe you should have waited to say some, say something, maybe, um, to a friend or associate, um, because you feel like they going to go back and say something. Um, you feel like they did this the last time. Your intuition is telling you, like, maybe, you know, maybe you should have kept it on the low. But you think that it's a, um, you know, the situation is toxic. So maybe you feel like, you know, you needed to say something. And the first card that jumped out is the Eight of Wands. All right. So... That's communication. Yeah, see, four of pentacles is you holding back. Two of swords, you're not sure. You're uncertain. If you should say something, page of pentacles, knight of wands, and the tower. Um, I feel like you could be worried about this Aries. Or this older male. I'm getting a masculine energy. However, I'm getting Knight of Wands. Could be a Leo, Sagittarius, Aries. Um, but yeah, I feel like you're uncertain about it. If you should say anything. You're not sure how to say it or you're not sure if you should say it. But you're holding back. You're holding back. This could involve family. This could involve family. The emperor could be a father figure or a father in Genesis 333 on the phone. Um, I see you. Somebody feel could feel like something could be too, there's too many rules. Um, you feel like Either somebody walked away or somebody's contemplating walking away. But you love this person. You love, you love this person. Could be a Leo or an Aquarius. You're just hoping that somebody, that the truth comes out because it's breaking your heart to see, to see this. Okay, so something is bothering you for sure. It could involve family. I see you thinking like something is not the best choice. Like you just feel like it's not the best choice. I'm seeing you change your mind. You don't want to you don't want to be around a lot of mess. So you feel like I'm seeing the empress here. This could have something to do with a a daughter, a mother, a female friend. 
I'm seeing the emperor and the empress. So I'm getting male figure, male energy and female energy. But somebody's like forcing somebody to stay or be stay home. Ooh. So this could involve children. This could be why this Knight of Wands is here. Somebody is like all kind of like all over the place. You know that this person's tired of hearing hearing your mouth, but you're going to tell it how it is. You're going to tell it how it is. You feel like it's, it's a child involved. You feel like this child deserves the best. Okay? And you plan on giving that to them. Um, yeah. I feel like for some of you, this could be involving a child. Like, for some of you, it's your own child. For some of you, it's someone else's child. Maybe, like, a sibling's child. or um, You've been holding back what you want to say for a while. Yeah, but you're going to go ahead and say it. We got the fool. It's, gonna, you're gonna, it's like you just want to blurt it out. <laughs> and it's like it's never going to be a right time. So why not just say it? Um, somebody's greedy. Queen of Pentacles and the Devil. Somebody's real greedy. They argue all the time. Um, and this breaks your heart. You may have talked, been communicating with your friends on the phone about it, and it's like you don't had enough. There could be a King of Wands involved, a Leo Sagittarius Aries. You want a choice to be made now. Yep. You want a choice to be made now. I feel like you've been you've been holding back, but you you getting ready to say <laughs> you getting ready to say how you feel. Yep. Four of Pentacles, Ace of Swords, and the Two of Wands. It's time. It's time. And see, that was a challenge. Maybe trying to find out when would be the right time for you to to say how you feel. But it's been on your mind for a while. You've been wanting to say something. But you feel like whoever this energy is, I'm getting kink of wands. Could be a male. Doesn't necessarily have to be a fire sign. I got king of swords here as well. Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, or a fire sign, Leo, Sagittarius, Aries. But you feel like enough is enough. You feel like enough is enough. Oh, yes. Five of Wands and a Devil. Like, yeah, this situation may have been, like, domestic violence involved. It could have been some that things just got way, like, it, it, it was bad. It was bad. Okay, now it's, like, it's time to speak up about it. This could involve a friend, but this person is, like, family to you. Yeah. Yes, it's like you've been waiting on this day. You've been waiting on this day. Somebody tried to do it themselves. Somebody tried to do something themselves, but somebody it's like it, it it didn't happen when they tried to do it themselves. So somebody does not want to be in a relationship. Somebody does not want to get back together. Somebody, you think that this person needs to work on their confidence, on their self-esteem. And you, you, when you talk to this person, you would rather hear good things. You would rather hear Ten of Cups energy. And somebody could have been married to, married to this person. I'm getting a husband for sure. We got the Hierophant and the Emperor here. I'm getting like a husband. And that's not everybody's situation, but it could be an Aries or a Taurus. You feel like it's time. Okay, it's time. It's time to get this done. Yep, it's time to get this done. Time to get this over with. Now, this could be in regards to, like, a separation or a divorce for some. Why the three of swords here? Yep. And the chariot. It's time to move on. Okay? It's time to move on. 
and you telling this person, look, if you can't afford it, don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. I got you. You need to be focused on what's ahead of you, what's going on in front of you right now. Yeah. Okay, so you're you're putting your two cents on the situation. I'm not sure if this is even you. I feel like for some of you, this could be your situation. For some of you, this could be someone that you're around. Because I see you, like, talking on the phone with somebody. Like, somebody calling you and telling you, telling you about this or talking to you about this. Yep. Ooh, the Knight of Wands and the Devil. Gosh. Oh, this was real toxic. It was, uh, this is all over the place energy. Yeah. And you, this situation could have really messed with your esteem, your self-esteem. It could have had you in a really low place. Um, yes, it's like, you, you really gave this situation a shot. But you feel like, you know, it's time to move on. This person was hella toxic. When I say hella toxic, oh my gosh. Why was the devil in? Could be a Capricorn. Let's uh, see. Pay the swords. Ooh, the justice. You want justice in this situation. You've been watching this person. You've been keeping your eye on this person, possibly online. You want justice in this situation. I'm telling you, this could be, we got the Empress here. This could be someone's, this could be someone's child that is getting out of a toxic situation. I'm just feeling that. Yeah. You feel like there's another person in the picture. You feel like it's another person in the picture. Queen of Wands, Leo, Sagittarius, Aries, King of Pentacles, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn. You feel like it's another person. Like, you was waiting on this person. You was waiting for the situation. You was waiting for the situation to come to a head. I see you even celebrating, like, yes, this is over. Let's let's go ahead and move forward. Let's go ahead and press forward. This situation is a mess. And I'm just, I feel like I'm just here. Oh, I'm just glad that's over. We got the tower moving ahead. So what's to come? We got the tower. We got something out of the blue. That's a oh look at the sun. The sun is shining. Whoa. Oh. Yes. Look at this. The eight of cups is being happy that you walked away from this situation. Walking away happy with your faith. You've been praying. You've been praying for this day. Ooh, you feel like somebody got taken advantage of. You feel like somebody got taken advantage of. You couldn't wait for this day. You couldn't wait for this day. You so happy. It's like this just this happened out of the blue. This was random. And you're like, I'm so happy that this is over. I'm so happy. I'm so happy. And then look, I just tried to shuffle and look what came out again. Now this is on the bottom of the deck. It flew out. Like, yes. Walking away happy. Walking away happy. Happy that you walked away. Look at this. An answered prayer. This is something that you prayed about. This was something that you was just like hoping that was going to happen. You was hoping that this was going to... Ten of Wands. Ten of Wands. This situation was so draining. I feel like for some it was a marriage. And I feel like you wanted this, you know... To, to balance out at one point but it takes two and you think it's not the right time you was thinking at that point like gosh 
gosh, 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 gosh. I, I see you just being being happy that some that I, I, for some reason I'm feeling like for some of you this could be your situation. But I've been keeping my eyes on Gemini's a lot lately because I I never forget a few months back I did a reading for Gemini's and Gemini's have come a long way. Gemini's have come a very long way. And but for some reason I'm just getting like being that being that how it's starting out like somebody I'm getting like you're more open to talking about it now but I'm feeling I keep getting a feeling of just the way that this looks it's saying like I know you're tired of going through this I'm, I'm not sure if this is you for some of you this could be your situation for some of you this involves a family member you're just so happy look at this made the decision to walk away this situation was so stressful okay this situation was causing so much stress you want better you want better a leo could be involved but you want your confidence back you want this person to have their confidence back you regret look at this you feel bad it was a lot of disagreements a lot of regrets okay and I, I keep getting with this nine ones and the star ones. I'm getting that there was like domestic violence could have been. Ooh, I'm so, I'm so proud of y'all. So this is you and your situation. I'm so proud of y'all. Yeah, like I'm getting. Like, a lot of anxiety. Like, you telling this person, like, slow down, slow down. Okay, slow down. Tell me what happened. Um, You know, give me the tea, but, but slow down. Yep. I'm getting all the details are coming out. This person could, look, listen. You could have a new relationship on the horizon. If this isn't you... They're, they have a new relationship on the horizon, okay? Could could possibly be with the King of Cups, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, but this person is going to cater to their emotions, cater to your emotions. This person is going to be loving, caring, sensitive, possibly. Could be a water sign, Pisces, Cancer, or Scorpio. And I want to say this for future, for future references. Make sure that you're using your intuition when you jump in something new. And make sure that you're healing before you've healed from a situation if this is you going through this. Make sure that you've healed from this past situation before you jump into a new connection. Because I see a new connection coming, but I see a, a little bit of insecurities and feeling like you're going to get played or feeling like this person is cheating or lying. Like, you just don't trust. I see trust issues. Some of y'all feeling like, you know, the best thing to do is to be single. Okay, and I and I just said that. Take some time. Take some time. Take your time. Don't rush. Don't rush. Don't rush. Let this situation fizzle out. Okay? Let this situation fizzle out. A new love is coming. A new energy is coming in. But can you trust it? Okay? Make sure that you're using your intuition on, on this situation. If this is you and, and this could be a family member or a friend, you're a very good person for being a listening ear to this situation. Because I feel like this situation was... was was bad it was toxic all right gemini so that's the message that i got for y'all i hope this message um reaches who it needs to reach and y'all take care all right and i'm gonna chat with y'all on the next one ciao for now